Every day is a struggle. I come to work and feel like I sit in meetings all day, but I never really get to see anyone. I have Zoom fatigue. Side effects of Zoom fatigue might include an ability to know how to engage without a screen, a sense of loss if no one has an animal in their background, an obsession with Zoom background screens, constipation, saying you're muted multiple times a day. But you're not alone. Here are some tips to beat Zoom fatigue. And I just remember thinking, if I have to do one more Zoom call, um, I, I, I just can't do this job anymore. And so what I started to realize was I could control what I participated in. So first things first, you can always say no. This stretchy thing that you can stretch underneath the camera and people will not know that you're stretching and people will not know that you are twisting this down and having fun. I'm taking a break and getting up. Uh, earlier today, we got up and we took a walk around the Publix parking lot. It doesn't have to be anything special. The advantage of Zoom is that you only have to dress up, but you don't have to dress down. I cannot wait to meet with people again. Zoom fatigue is a smaller symptom of working during the coronavirus. Zoom fatigue is not a real illness, but these tips and tricks may help subside your increased boredom during meetings or help you get through the day. If you do feel as if you do have just plain fatigue, you may want to see a doctor. Push past Zoom fatigue. Visit VAUMC.org slash Zoom fatigue for more tips and best practices.